What's up, this is Keith Kelfis, and in this video, I'm going to be reviewing the Echo PV2520 handheld gas powered blower versus the Milwaukee M18 Fuel electric handheld blower. Before I get started, I just want to be clear, this is not a pain. so don't even go there. Come over here, we'll start with the Echo. Alright, so we're going to start out with the Echo PB2520, the handheld blower, gas powered, state of the art technology. I actually visited the, the Echo factory in Lake Zurich, Illinois, and it was amazing, the technology. These motors never blow up. I use Still, I use Echo, I use Husqvarna, Milwaukee, all of them. I like them all because they all get the job done. So I'm really excited to try out this. Putting in some mixed gas. And just to be clear, I'm putting in my own mix. Race, oh wow, I'm trapping on the way down. I'm grinding on like a holy rail and I'll hit the slow some go hound. Pray, oh no, I cannot take this slow. I'm grinding on like the holy rail and I'll hit the slow some go crawl. Yeah, race, oh wow. I'm trapping on the way down. I'm grinding on like the holy rail and now hit the slow. Break or no, I cannot take this slow. I'm grinding on like the holy rail and now hit the slow and go pro. Yeah, please don't take that powder. You don't got no reason. Moving on top of mountains, home and got crap no breathing. I think I've gone too far. I can honestly say this is the most powerful handheld blower I've ever used. This has the same exact power as like one of the smaller backpack blowers, goals to be completely honest. But this is so good that I can actually see myself grabbing this instead of putting on the big BR700. Obviously if we're doing big uh, fall cleanups or blowing a lot of stuff, this is perfect for a quick blowdown. This would be badass for a homeowner. Now, we're gonna try the Milwaukee.
I'm gonna do a side by side for sure. <laughs> Prognosis. Check this out. All right, so testing them out pretty good. Not all different environments, obviously, but I really like the Milwaukee, and I could see myself using it all the time. I have it now, so it's going to be on my truck. Perfect. Like, imagine, like, you know how when you're cutting grass or something, and you forgot to blow down the window sill. It's like, oh, you got to go get the backpack blower again. This is perfect for grabbing this and then just running around and spot touching up something that you might have missed window sills, front door stoops. Yeah, you can stick a ball on the top and like, I have a ball with me. Ever do that? You can, like take a beach ball and make it float to any of the customers come out. They're like, dude, you're hired. <laughs> and then this, this is uh, the most powerful handheld blower I've ever used. Side by side, you saw the video. And I would say that the winner goes to I say that the winner goes to Echo, but only by a little bit. You can see when it's blowing, and I can actually feel, this has obviously, I mean, it's got a gas-powered motor in it. It's got a little bit more horsepower for moving a little bit more mass, but as far as, the thing about the design in this, the way that, would I say the velocity, let me know in the comments below, the velocity of the wind, it's so, the, the way it's tuned, the way this port is tuned is like perfect so that it makes up for anything that this that it doesn't have by not having a motor. But they're literally neck and neck. The, the Echo is just a little bit more powerful than the Milwaukee. And to me that says for the ease of use, the ergonomic, the functionality, you can literally just pop a battery and charge it and go. Now, in all honesty, when you've been landscaping or doing lawn care your whole life, you're just totally so deeply ingrained in the habit of using gasoline and always having gas, right? If you have to pay attention to one more thing like charging something, um, I'm sure you could have a power inverter in your truck. They do make those. Or you could just have batteries that you rotate out. It would just be as simple as developing the new habit of having that going. This thing is badass, by the way, though. The Echo PB2520 handheld blower versus the Milwaukee M18 fuel electric powered blower. I'm Keith Kelfis. Thank you so much for watching this review the video. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up button. Let me know what you think in the comments below and hit that subscribe button. Bam! Just hit the subscribe button. Bam! Just hit the subscribe. Bam! Just hit the subscribe button right now. And turn on notifications so we can stay in touch, dog. Something is wrong with the way, and I don't know why. Why, why, why? How do you get by, by, by? You've been away way long.